listening to his stories. So many ideas running through his head. Things I have never heard anybody say, even though I didn't understand half of what came out of his mouth. He spoke with so much passion. <laughs> I'd make fun of him for talking with his hands so much. Later, he told me it really was just to distract his mind, a habit he developed as a child to stop stuttering. I don't know why I remember that. There's nothing thinner than the line between love and hate, followed closely by the paper-thin drawer in our apartment. Though she tells me every day, sometimes I wonder. No, I, I don't think I can do this anymore. No. I love her so much, but I can't say it now. She'll tell me I'm only saying it to make her happy. Funny, I forget most of our arguments. There weren't many, but at the time they seemed so important. Yet, I can still tell you what that fortune cookie said. Never be the same again. The first time I saw her, I swear my heart skipped two beats. She brightened up the room and we're outside. Says stuttering a bit. I normally don't do this. I mean, I do draw people all the time, but I never think to, you know, show them or. I tell them. I like your glasses. They're nothing special. Really, I just like his eyes. He says. The lips aren't quite right. Probably because I was but... trying not to smile the whole time. He compares it to Mona Lisa and the Buddha. I have no idea how the two relate. It's kind of weird, but still flattering. He asks, Do you want me to tear it out? I'll sign it so you remember me. Yeah, it's okay. She tells me. I'll see it when it's finished. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. All right. She says, looking oh. back. Just uh, text me when it's finished, okay? Word. I can't believe I gave him my number. I never do that. You never do that. I know, right? <sighs> it's him. <laughs> is that him? Yeah, it is. <laughs> Brunch? I normally wouldn't. You wouldn't. But he insists on showing me in person. As soon as I see him, I know why I gave him my number. Why? The way he looks at me, it's like he can't see anyone else.
So, you seen anyone else yet? It's been over two years. Makes you hold on you or something. The line between love and hate is so thin, it's almost invisible. We don't even notice it, till something bumps up against it.